Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be teaching you how to get auto touch. So all you need is your phone to be jailbroken and it's going to be a really easy video to follow along. So in the description and in the comments, you're going to see these two links that you need. Um, I'm going to put it obviously in there and all you have to do is go on the first link first. And when you go on the link, you should see the whole section of the page and you want to go on add to Cydia in the middle, not the one at the top, the add official repo. That one pretty much takes you to Cydia and you can install the source and you just want to install it, give it a few seconds and uh, once it installs, you will see what I mean. All right, so now that is downloaded, what you want to do is actually go on sources so you can actually download auto touch. So you should see auto touch, go on that, all packages, and download auto touch uh, click on modify at the top and install so now again what you want to do is actually give it a few seconds this one takes a bit longer for me so uh, I'm just gonna skip it so you don't have to wait for it all right so what happens after this is downloaded you should see the auto touch is now on your home screen so as you can see auto touch is here but we're not done so what you have to do is go on the second link in the description or comments whichever you guys want and uh, once you go in it you want to actually go add source to Cydia and as soon as you go on there, what you want to do is actually go and go continue to source. When you go on that, all packages at the top and download the first thing there. Active, I can't say it, active widget, I think. Okay. But either way, you download the first one and uh, once you install it, it pretty much lets you use auto touch. So we're just going to wait for it and it's already done so we can actually go on it. Alright, so now you should have auto touch and activator on your screen. I love how activator doesn't even have an image. But you want to go on the bottom right for settings and um, go on activator. On It should be under control. Go on action for main control. Got it. And you want to try and find motion and shake device. So when you find that, you want to activate it because what happens is that when you shake your device, auto touch will pretty much do the rest for you. And it's much more easier when you do that. And as you can see here, I just shook my device and this is what pops up. So what you want to do is go on the app that you want to use auto touch for. So I'm going to use paste bits and I'm going to open up the packs. And what happens is that I'm going to shake my device and record what I'm going to do. So I'm going to click record and I'm going to open the packs. So pretty much what I'm doing is I'm doing a recording of what I want the auto touch to do. So I'm just going to open two packs quickly. And then what I'm going to do is shake my device to end the recording. That's all you have to do. So it should say right now, um, record and finish, as you can see. I'm going to play it again. So I'm shaking my device right now. And you should see this popping up again. I'm going to go on records and use it. So you see it says playing started. Um, I only did it twice. And the auto touch is going to do um, what you did in your recording. So I only opened two packs and it's going to end as soon as the two packs is done. So it says play and finish. But that's what that's not what I want to do. So I'm going to go on auto touch. Go on the bottom left uh, on loco. So you can go on records and go on the eye on the right hand side and go on play and settings. So as you can see here, we have the whole thing settings here. Go on times and change it to how many however many times you guys want it. So I'm just going to put 9999 uh, and you can go back on the app. And pretty much it will do it unlimitedly for you guys and you guys can do something else so for example i'm on packwin right now i'm going to shake my device and you can see this pops up i'm not clicking anything at all i promise you guys it's doing this itself so i can literally just chill watching youtube or something while this auto touch is in the background and it's really useful so yes Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like I said again, guys, all you have to do is shake your device to activate it. You go on the records so you can see all this um, different rec uh, records you've done. And all you have to do to deactivate it and shake your device again. This is the easiest way to do it because if you had other ways, it would be really confusing. So shaking your device is possibly the best thing to do. Uh, I'm going to shake my device to end it here. And as you can see, it says playing has stopped. So yeah, that's it for this video. Please drop a like if you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys very soon. Peace out.